Hello and welcome to Tim Brook Honda. Today I have a nice bike. This is a 2005 Suzuki Boulevard. It's the C90T, which is a 1500cc bike. Really nice cruiser. A very comfortable cruiser. A little bit of the story on this. This bike is owned, was owned by an older gentleman. And it had set for a couple years and brought it in for a trade-in. Since it was sitting, I replaced both tires. And we went over the entire bike. We put brakes on it. I did a full tune-up on it. And we took and uh, cleaned out all the fuel, replaced the fuel, cleaned out everything. Everything's ready to go, uh, complete tune-up on it. The bike really starts and rides really nice. I'll point out a couple things that I can see. Front fender, he said his neighbor backed into it a little bit and you can see a little bit of a crease right there. And again, now this bike hasn't been detailed yet, so it needs to be detailed yet. And some of this mark will come out, but a little bit of a crease right there again. Not a big deal, but you can see it, so I don't want to not point that out. It originally has a windscreen as well as a backrest and some saddlebags. Saddlebags were just leather bags and they looked pretty nasty, just dirty and, and old, so I pulled those off. And the backrest was an aftermarket backrest, so it didn't survive very well. It just, was, it just didn't look good. The, the chrome on it just was a little uh, dull and a little pitted, so. I took all that stuff off and I kind of like the original look of just the bear bike itself anyway. Um, it's got Vance and Hines on it. We did a, uh, I don't know if I said this or not, but we did the complete service oil change. We did a full tune up on it. All new fuel, all new brakes, all new tires. And they did a 50 point check on it. I put about 40 miles on this bike myself and I am really impressed with this bike. The engine sounds very strong. Uh, the steering is good. The suspension really feels good. It's a good handling bike with more than enough power. I really like this bike. I've at least 40 miles on it, and I'm probably gonna put some more on it. This is a nice riding bike. Uh, on the side of it, just to point out anything I see here, just a little bit of rust right there on that bolt. If that bolt was removed and cleaned, put back in that, it'll be fine. No pits on it. Uh, back wheel, this back wheel needs cleaned up a little bit, but again, we have not detailed this, you can tell. I haven't even washed it, really. Back fender's good. Um, I'm trying to see anything. Just a couple little marks right there, but again, not noticeable. No scratches or marks on the back fender other than that. Let me see. That little tiny mark right there, I'll buff that out. Back wheel, again, just needs cleaned, polished seats real good I like the studded seat it actually looks good on this bike uh, this side panel these have been hitting up against there like they do on most of these which I can't really figure out why they did that but anyway this is the only gnarly part of the bike this needs sanded down and either just masked off or some type of wrap put around there other than that I don't see any other damage to the paint I see a little bit of dirt down here the engine's still hot so I don't want to touch it but that'll rub off uh, the tank's in very good shape. Again, the chrome's in good shape. Dash is in good shape. 29,412 miles. Vance and Hines sounds great. Uh, this is an enjoyable bike. I really like it. Let's see if I can start her up for you and make sure it's in neutral. Fuel pump's running good. And I guess I gotta pull in the clutch. Feel free to give us a call.